Hi guys, it's Dee from Sarah Design along with my partner in crime. Guess who's with us today? Sarah. Sarah, say hi. 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 We are doing a haul video. Today is April 28th, 2020. We are in the middle of the coronavirus quarantine. However, we had to go out today and get a few staple items for the house while we were out and about. We try not to go out too much, but when we go, we try to get everything we possibly need and get back so we don't have to go out for a while. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and give us a great big thumbs up. We'd appreciate it. And we'll get on with the video. We are doing a whole video today is from Dollar Tree and Walmart and Family Dollar and we did do, go to Lowe's for a few items so we are it's going to be a long one I'm going to try to do this as quickly as possible but I know you guys like haul videos so let's get started I'm going to stay with the theme stay with the theme I'm going to start with the theme of crafting what do you think of that Sarah go for it we're good with that Shut all up. right crafting we are crafters as you may or may not know so it keeps us busy during quarantine to do some crafting things. So at the Dollar Tree, I'm going to start with Dollar Tree. We Crafter Square is one of Dollar Tree's um, many companies that Dollar Tree purchases from, I guess. What do you call them? Vendors? Whatever they are. Um, so anyway, we got a lot of Crafter Square stuff. Um, this is uh, pop-up tape. Some people call it dimensional tape. There's three different sizes here. It's a three-pack for a dollar. Um, you can see my hand versus the sizes. You get a good bit here. We do go through a lot of tape with our crafting. So, you got that. I got this 528 piece pop up dot adhesives. There's two sheets, they're little tiny squares. I found my earring. Where was it? I don't know, but it fell onto my leg. <laughs> okay, um, real quick. Sarah was throwing me a bag earlier, because this is take two of this video, by the way. Um, and as she was throwing it, her earring got caught. She's got like 20 holes in her ears. In my head. In your head, yeah. And one of the earrings got caught onto something and fell out. So we've been looking for it for quite some time, or she has. I've just been kind of supervising. Ignoring what? Ignoring me. Ignoring her, yeah. Um, so anyway, back to this. Um, I'm glad you found it. Yeah. yeah. Um, so anyway, here's these little... Pop dot adhesives. There's two sheets, like I said. There was some more adhesives. Uh, here's double sided tape. It's the thin stuff. It's thin, 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 thin from Crafter Square. Um, acid free, archival free. There's 33 feet of this stuff in here. Aren't you happy? No. <laughs> There's also these little dots, the magic adhesive dots. I don't know if you can see them. I'm going to put my glasses on. Maybe I can see. Can you see the dots? Yeah, you can see them there. There's one here. Anyway, they're the magic adhesive dots. You get 72, 72 of them in here for a dollar. Dollar Tree. Uh, cra ca Crafter Square, again, piercing and scoring tool set. Fine and medium point needles. Can you see that? Let's open it. With a bone folder on the other side. Let's open so we can see it better. Ooh, they come right off. You can see it better. Oh, it's good. Heavy plastic. They do have these little things. Hopefully they stay on and not fly off every time you go to pull something out, pull them out. That that seems very dangerous to me. Like it would they would the lids would fall off. So be careful with that if you do get that. Um, we also got this palette knife set. They're plastic, but you get three for a dollar. Sarah likes to use them. We also, my husband's diabetic and he needs to keep track of his, his blood sugar levels. So if this is a teacher's lesson planner, but it has the days of the month. He can put the, the week, the, the date. And then he can put his readings here. It's big enough for him because he's diabetic. He does have trouble seeing. There's 28 pages in here. And he can't... 28, did I say? Yeah, 28 sheets. It's 9 by 5.7. 
Um, so that'll be good for him to keep track of his stuff. There's also a little notebook for my mother-in-law. She lives with us. We bought the house from her and we are remodeling it. Uh, little by little, but anyway, she lives with us and she uses these notebooks all the time to write down whatever in. So it was only a dollar, just 100 pages in there. Got that for her. Also, for my husband, we got him these glasses. They're 3.25. These are magnifying reading glasses. This is the only kind we use. Um, they're a dollar. You can't beat that. And he can see out of them. I wear them too. They're called cheaters. We call them cheaters. Crafter Square, again, is an art palette. You get six of them. They're plastic. They're hard plastic. Do we have any in here that are already open? Sarah? Mm -hmm. I'm going to open this. We use these a lot to mix paints and whatnot. And they are fabulous. Hard plastic. You can reuse them, rinse them off. They're great. We already had a bunch of them, but I don't know where they all are. We've moved studios from upstairs in our craft room. We had a small little room to down here in a bigger room. One day I'll show you a video, a tour. A tour, like it's a big, huge place. <laughs> we'll do a little tour of the studio. Um, dropped stickers. There's 216 of these little pearlescent little sticker doohickeys. Um, this is like a rosy pink. I got the blue. I got the white pearl and the red. For some of my crafting pages. Um, I got these metallic markers. They're white. Forever in time. Called forever in time metallic marker. It does work. I used it in here earlier. So that works. Back, out. Of phone Back on my phone okay. case. Yes. I, I got no one's going to say it. I got two of them. For one. They're a dollar each. I only got two. I should have got more. What was it that I called you earlier? I stopped calling you mother and started calling you what? Super smart, wonderful person. I'm pretty sure it was child. Oh, I got. She did call me child. Why? Because you started acting like a child. Me? Never. Never me. Okay. This I opened already for take one, but this is Crafter Square. It's a pencil and brush organizer. It's got 49 spots that you can put brushes tools pens pencils markers whatever in it is i got two of them one for sarah one for myself we have hundreds hundreds when i say hundreds i mean probably thousands not thousands but probably a few hundred pens and markers and pencils probably closer to like five six hundred if i had to guess but anyway it's pretty easy i just snap it all together somehow or another i don't know it looks pretty easy. I don't know. Put the thing in the thing. And then you put this on top. Upside down. And then, so it looks like it would work out pretty well for us. I will let you know how that works out for us. But it's cheap plastic. But it's only a dollar. I think it'll be fine for what we need it for. I don't think we'll have any issues. Alright, next up we have... Sarah got this for my husband. He's a motorhead. Um, pedal to the metal. It's like a little pencil case or like a little tin that he can put stuff in, whatever. So, it's a nice sturdy little case for him. It was very thoughtful of her. I oh, think. Where's the rest of the art stuff, Sally? The dollar store today. We went to two different Dollar Trees today, because, and I'll tell you why in a second. But first one we went to, the lady says, you need any hand sanitizer? And I'm like, yeah, sure. So she said, it's only two per customer. I was a customer. Sarah had gotten her own stuff, so she was a customer. So we got two of these packs, little ones. They're lavender. They don't smell very good, though, honestly. But kills 99.9% .9 of the germs. They keep them behind the counter at the Dollar Tree. So we got four packs of these. Because we are running low. Then when we went to the other Dollar Tree, we had two different orders. One of Sarah's was getting my husband the glasses and my order. So the lady says, do you need hand sanitizer? And we're like, sure. Because we only had those little bottles left. She had the big bottles. So she was given these big ones, two per customer. So Sarah got two and I got two, which is great. I have one in the car now. Keep one in the house. Yada, yada, yada. 
Alright, so one of the main reasons why we went to the Dollar Tree today was because I saw some people online complaining about their masks, their quarantine masks, that they're hurting their ears. And somebody else had posted a picture of this like little bracket that you put on the back of the ear thing. You make it out of plastic and it attaches so that you don't have to have it attached to your ear. You can just have it going behind your head kind of thing. I'm going to see if Sarah can edit it and put a picture in somewhere in here for you so you can see exactly what it is. But the reason I went was because I wanted to make some and put them online and say, anybody want any, come get them or where are you? I'll drop them off kind of thing. Um, they make them out of these chopping mats. Um, they're in the cooking section. You get two of them for a dollar. Um, it's a hard, heavy duty plastic, but it's flexible. One side's frosty soft, the other side's smooth shiny. So I'm going to try it out. I got three packs of them, so there's six total. Um, they're long strips like this, so I could probably get maybe one, two, I don't know, maybe ten on here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Probably ten. Ten on a, on a sheet. I'll let you know how that works out. If it doesn't work out, I, I'm a crafter. Like I said, I love stencils. Um, I just found out that I could make my own. I've been trying it out with different plastics to make different ones. And this might be a good plastic for it. I'm going to do a video soon to show how I do that and the different plastics I've been using and how they've been working out. So stay tuned for that. So that's that. Along with my stencils, I need a place to put them. So, I found these. There was three of these in a packet. They're like little plastic, really thin plastic folders. Three for a dollar. And then there, these were two for a dollar. This one has little kitty cats on it. How cute is that? So, we found those. Went to the other Dollar Tree. They didn't have those. I was going to get more of them. Stencils. Like I said, I love stencils. This is a super thin plastic from Crafters Solution. Uh, Crafters after square um super thin but it's cool um stencil flower so got that one and staying with the subject of making your own stencils i found these really cool they're like folder things but they're like 3d-ish like look how cool how cool are these Remember back in school, like you had them, they have that noise. So anyway, I got total five. Um, and I figured I could use the back pieces for the stencil because it's thick. So I'm going to try that out for stencil making. Um, and then speaking of stencils, I'm only going to show you a few of them. Sarah has some Halloween ones. I don't know where she put them. They're over there somewhere. They have these wheels. They're called Jot Do-It-Yourself Project wheels. Stencil wheel. Um, and you see, you just spin it around and you have your, your stencil in here. They're a dollar. Um, this one has road trip on it. Sarah, do you know where yours are? Mm -hmm. So I got a few of them. They have a sword. They have a whole bunch of different ones. I'm going to show you Sarah's Halloween ones real quick. Sarah loves Halloween, as you know, or you may or may not know. She's addicted. Halloween's her thing. Um, so anything Halloween we see, we get. Sarah is 23, by the way. She's not four. But. <laughs> what? Because it's like anything, like, give me, like, I don't want to say any name brand, anything, but anything puppy related, Sarah gets. Because Sarah's a little four-year-old, but Sarah's not a little four-year-old. Sarah's a 23-year-old. A 23. She's addicted to Halloween. She's a collector. Let's say that. There you go. There's those. I'm riding. Moving right along. I'm running along, running along. I think we're done with crafting stuff. I'm going to move on to other stuff from the Dollar Tree. They have tissues. Scotty tissues. They're all awesome tissues. They're not super thin. I use them every single day. Um, they're a dollar. A box like this for a dollar. Or you can get the longer boxes for a dollar. But I like these because I can put them next to my bed. Um, I got a couple packs of those. Sarah is, we are now doing some gardening because it is springtime. Sarah's getting into it, so she's been planting some seeds. And she got this little thing for her 
plants. Sarah got some makeup. She got Maybelline Lasting Drama. This is called Star Starlight Gold Eyeliner. She got Hard Candy Felt Tip Eyeliner. This is in blue. In the navy, it's called. I have this. I use it every day. I have it in black. It's phenomenal. Uh, she also got the Lip Gloss Watermelon Scented. Little watermelon shape. How cute. Hard Candy, again. This has a little soft, cushy um, case on it here. Um, with these eye, pretty eyeshadows. They're like pearlescent. Hard candy eyeshadow. She got these two pens. These were from Family Dollar, actually. These were a dollar each. They're called Rare Gem Pens. They're plastic. They're pretty roses. We got this from Dollar Tree still. Well, this was from Dollar Tree. Um, this was supposed to be attached to this, but it broke off. This is our logo. We have three stars on our Sarah Design logo. Um, but anyway, she got that. She said it was the last one they had. No, I didn't get one. It's okay, though. Um, so she got that. She also got this basket. When we go to the store, she'll grab a basket, one of these kind of baskets, instead of getting an actual basket to walk around with. And she'll put stuff in it, and then she ends up buying the basket. No, but I have a reason for it. So she does have a reason for it, and let's hear the reason, Sarah. So, when I'll go in the stores with my mother... Or the child, as she's been, we've been calling her for the day. I won't plan on getting anything. So I'll start walking around, and then I'll see something I like, and I'll be like, alright, I'll get it. And then I see another thing I like, and then another. And my hands are small as is. Yeah, true. So, after like four tiny little things, my hands are full. So it's like, okay, well now I need a basket, and I don't feel like walking back to the front of the store, because I'm in the back of the store. So I'll find a basket. And she puts the stuff in the basket yeah. and then start continues to fill it up. Then we get up to the front of the thing. Instead of her saying, no, I don't want the basket, she ends up buying the basket. So. Do you ever not need a basket? We, we always use them, yes. Okay, back to the Dollar Tree. We have, like I said, I purchased the house for my mother-in-law. And we've been doing themed dining room. Dining room is our kitchen table, actually. So um, summer's coming. I love summer. Um, I love blue, so I got these pretty, what do you call these, placemats, because, I got four of them, because they match this fabulous table cloth, which is plastic, but it has the flannel on the back. We only use it for a season, and then I will try, if it's still clean and not holes in or anything, I will put it away and use it next year, but it's going to be destroyed. It will be destroyed, but it was only a dollar. Uh, when we got home, well, I got that, and then I was like, oh, they have these. They're so cute. These are for, like, on the oven. I put them on the oven. We don't use them, but they're for decoration, and that matches perfectly. I was like, oh, we'll get them. But then I saw these, and I really like these, and Sarah's like, oh, it'll still match. Get them anyway. So I got that, and then I got this one to stand tall. I don't know if I'll use that one. And then I got this dish drying mat. Honestly, I thought it was a bigger <laughs> bigger towel with dish drying mat, but we'll still use that. Then we get home, and I noticed that this is for a round table, and I have an oval table. We do have a round table outside, so I can put this hole in the middle of it for our umbrella and put this outside, even though it has a flannel backing I think it'll still be all right for a little while anyway. So we went to a different Dollar Tree to see if we could get the oval one. So I don't know about anyone else's area, like anyone else's county, or like like within four towns, there is about five Dollar Trees. Yeah, we no do. Joke. We do have a lot. They're very very convenient and close to us. And if you don't, can't find something at one, you can find some the other. Actually, there's one, two, three. Four, yeah, you're right. There's four, like, within a 10-minute drive for us. Yeah. So, anyway, I did find the oval one for upstairs for our... We're down in the studio, but for upstairs in our dining room. So, that works out. Dollar Tree also has their Easter candy on sale for, for a dollar. Because Easter just passed, and...
and they didn't sell out because everyone was quarantined and they decided to bad. <laughs> so I did get a couple things of candy. There's another one of the eggs somewhere. Baskets or the bag of eggs. So anyway, yeah, my mother-in-law and my husband are both diabetics, but they need sugar sometimes. The sugar drops and they do like chocolate. So. And so does Sarah and I. So we got that. Um, trying to stay with Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree. Oh, I think that was it for Dollar Tree, correct? Um, there's another tissue box. I think so. Okay, so we're going to Family Dollar now. Family Dollar has these lights that I got last week. These outdoor lights. They're string lights. They were twelve dollars, and my and this is only twelve feet, fourteen feet the cord, the total length. It has 20, 20 lights on it, and it wasn't long enough for what we needed. So my husband's like, "You need like two more of these." I was like, "Okay, fine." So we go to Family Dollar to get two more. So I get there, they don't have any. They're out. So I saw these for five dollars. There's 6.5 feet, so I got five of them. You can string one to the other. There's 10 in there. And my daughter said to me, I don't think they're the same bulbs. I'm like, yeah, they are. Nope, she was right. They're not the same. But I got them anyway. We'll figure something out with it. They were $5 each, so I got those. They also have, which I got the other day, here. Um, the little bulbs, Sarah. You know where the little bulbs are? Little bulbs, yeah. They're little, there. They're solar panel little bulbs. How cute are these? And they hang with this little clip here. Back in the day, we used to call them roach clips, but for real. Back in, my, back in my hippie days. Um, anyway, they clip on. I have them hanging in my tree. They're so stinking cute. They have a little solar thing here. You turn on the light, or turn it on or off. Apparently that one's not charged. And there's that one. I know one of them was just on a minute ago. There we go. Can you see that? And it went off. Must not be charged enough. Oh, I had to cover it. I'm such an idiot. Anyway, they're really cute at night hanging in a tree. So I got a bunch of, not a bunch, I got like four or five more of them. Um, I already have like ten in the tree. That was that. What else from the dollar store, Sarah? I got this thing of hefty, hefty cinch sack. No. Uh, 33 30 gallon large trash bags. We go through trash bags like crazy here. So I got those. They were $9.99. Oh, these were the Dollar Tree as well. I got these cups. They're nice size. I got four of them. A dollar each. I love that color blue. Um, oh, Dollar Tree again. Sorry. We're gardening. This is called a transplanter. It was $1 at the Dollar Tree. Sarah also has a little rake thingy. Here it is here. It's actually called a cultivator. It's a dollar. Not that. Had to go to Walmart. Had to get a few things there. I basically wanted a bath mat because mine's ruined. I got a window treatment um, curtains. <laughs> window treatment. That's what they're called. Now I'm thinking about it. They might not be the right size. I don't know. I'll have to check it out. All my windows up in my dining room are currently burgundy, like a reddish kind of winter color. So we got this one. It'll be lighter. And does it match with the rest of the decor uh -huh. up there? So I got these. Um, these were six dollars each. Around about. Around about that. Yeah. Um, bath mat I got. I needed a new bath mat for my bathroom. This is like a memory foam. Oh, it's so soft. I can't wait to put my feet on it. The only problem is we have a man in the house. 
ladies, you know how that is. It'll get ruined quick because he doesn't aim right. I'm not a good aimer. Anyway, to stick with that theme, that color, I got these tails from my grand, my grandmother, my mother-in-law, Sarah's grandmother, um, for Christmas. I got her purple ones, and they're nice and thick. They're not bad, actually. She loves them. She asked me to get her a couple more. I got her a couple more, and then we use these. We actually are end up, we're now using pool tails is what we use. Yeah. Um, so these were $3 each, so I figured let's get a couple of them. So I got three of these. One for each of us, and then I got us the, 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 the washcloths to go with it. They're nice and thick and plush. Um, so right now our shower curtain burgundy for winter. So we are waiting for summer to come and stay forever. We live in Northeast Pennsylvania, so that doesn't happen. We, in the, we live in northeast of the United States, southeast of Pennsylvania. We're right outside of Philly, if you couldn't tell by our accent, which I don't hear. Do we have an accent? Do we have an accent? Um, you should see the face Sarah just made. Anyway, we got this shower curtain. It's so stinking cute. It's a fabric shower curtain. I have no idea how much this thing cost. How much was this sucker, Sarah? It's under $10, I'm sure. It's like a beachy theme. Very nice. So that'll be nice in there. And then I needed a new dish tail, dish rack, dish drying, dish, what do you call this? A dish rack. Dish strainer, drainer. Strainer, drainer? Drainer, strainer, whatever it is. So I got this metal one. It's cute. It's got this little basket that goes on the back here. Somehow it came off. I don't know how to put it back on. I'll have to play with it and figure it out. But it didn't come with the bottom tray, and I don't want the stuff all over my counter. So I had to buy the dish drying mat, which I got. Was This was like $9 for the drying mat, and then the thing was like $8, $9. Um, so actually, the getting the other thing by mistake, thinking it was a towel, actually would work out okay for us. Um, what else, Sarah? Then we went to Lowe's because Sarah wanted to look at flowers and plants and I wanted to get some plants, flowers for out front of the house by the garage. So, like I said, we just purchased a home from my mother-in-law. We replaced two of the outdoor lighting with the, this exact light. Um, and then we redid our entire garage. There was no lights out front of the garage. So I got some really nice exotic ones. Not exotic. What do they call it? Real nice. Eccentric? Not eccentric. What are they? Electic, eclectic, eclectic. I don't know. They're really pretty. Um, outdoor lanterns for out front of the garage that are up, and I got them from Wayfair. I'll have Sarah insert a picture here, somewhere. I don't know why you keep thinking I can do these things. Because you can do it. And I needed one for outside the studio, so we got one today. For that, for this weekend, because it's supposed to be nice out. So, we also use these dusk to dawn lights, light bulbs. You just leave the light switch on, and the light goes on at dusk and off in the morning. Um, Mostly because I have to walk the dog in the middle of the night. In the middle of the night, the dog gets up, and Sarah's got to walk him out. My, he's a little butthead. My husband likes the white, bright white, which we have the two out front of the garage is bright white. But the two on the side is kind of a soft yellowy light. I didn't realize that this says soft white. I got three of them today for seven dollars each that maybe I can just switch them all out for the yellow but he doesn't like the soft white. He likes the bright white so I might just take these back. I don't know yet. I have to think about that or see if I could sell them to somebody. Um, what else Sarah? We got some dog treats for the doggy but he ate some of them already. Um, my husband did ask for did I show the, the light prong thingy? This, or light prong thingy, yeah, hello. My husband needed this. He only needed one, but there was two of them for $9.99, so $10 for two at Family Dollar with the switches. Um, I think that was it. That was it for our haul today. We did good shopping. Um, I hope you guys are still with us. If you are, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Um, 
If you are, comment below. Pumpernickel. I couldn't think of a word. <laughs> Just kidding. No. Pumpernickel. Mm -hmm. Comment below Pumpernickel if you're still with us. Have you made it to the end? Yay. Thank you. Um, make sure you subscribe to our channel. And we hope you enjoyed our video. And we hope you're all staying safe out there. And let us know if you want to see anything else, any other kind of content. We do plan on doing some... We have a, a quite a few crafting ones we plan on doing. I know a lot of people don't like them. They prefer the the whole videos, but we're crafters. It's what we do. So we're going to try to mix it up a little bit. But thanks for joining us. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for our next video and stay safe. Say goodbye, Sarah. Bye, Sarah. Bye.